Hey guys, Mechanic CG here, and welcome back to another episode of Assassin's Creed Odyssey. Today is episode number three, and we are doing this mission called In the Footsteps of Gods. Um, so we have to head up all the way up there by the looks of it. Uh, let's see what Icaros the Eagle says. Um, towards down. In there. Okay. Now, whereabouts is the entrance of the cave, though? Okay, so the entrance isn't towards this direction. Maybe it's around here? Who knows? Ah, so it is up here. Can I not? There we go. Right, so we've got a hunter's belt, which looks pretty decent. Uh, where are we supposed to go? How do I go down? How do I go down in the water? Ah, B. Hmm. Here we go. They won't ask any questions. Best keep out of sight. Right, well, I can't use arrows. Let's slice and dice. Nice, we got a bit of loot there. Now, how do we get out of here? Uh, 
That looks like a way out. And we're out. That was nice and easy. Ish. I mean, it was a little bit fiddly working out how to actually... Oh, no wonder we couldn't find the entrance. The other entrance was practically hidden. Right, here we go. Here's your thing. Excuse. Have you come back to talk about the spear? Yes. Oh, good. Tell me, did you find it? You mentioned a reward? Oh, of course. You've certainly earned it. Ah. There we go. Um, alright. That is that sorted out. Uh, next mission is... This one, the big break. Talk to the shipbuilder. There's a guy down here who builds ships for a living. Um, abilities. Let's see what we can spend. So we can upgrade our bows. Devastating shot. That's a good one. <clears throat> Bull rush. I think we did that. Um, we had that before, didn't we? Bull rush. Hang on. Do we have even more? Oh, we have two. Second win, that's a decent one. That'll give us a little bit of extra health when we need it. Right, shipbuilder, let's have a word with you. It's a fine ship, Telemenes. Alexios! She is that, ready to ride the waves for the right captain, and the right price. What will it take for you to part with her? <laughs> Couldn't let her go for less than 100,000. 100,000? Who has that much? Someone who's serious about buying a ship. You think craftsmanship like this is given away? What if I told you I had obsidian to trade? I tell you, I still need 100,000 drachmi. Besides, even if I took your obsidian, a ship this size needs an army to sail it. This is Cephalonia. I could always find someone down on their luck and willing to work for next to nothing to get off this island. The seas are treacherous now. Well, more than usual. It would be suicide. You're not being very helpful, Telemenes. Not sure if this helps, but rumor has it the Cyclops is coming for you and Marcos. Rumors mean nothing. Don't believe everything you hear. Rumor also has it his ship is docked in Kleptus Bay. His ship, you say? I'll have to pay Kleptus Bay a visit. Be careful. That one-eyed brute has a nasty temper. So I can 
take his ship and deal with the <coughs> at the same time. Two birds, one storm. Indeed. Right, so the mission is quite far away actually. Is it still on the same island? Surprisingly it is. That is a long way. So if that's 700 meters then... Yeah, this is a huge map. Huge map. Um... Right. Let's get out of the way. Uh, and then we can call our horse and get our horse to pretty much fast troll us there. Um, I think we're out of the way enough now. Off we go now. What a perfect outfit. Oh, right, we are here at Kleptus Bay. Um, so I'm guessing we're going to have to uh, take a look around here. Oh. Dealt with. This used to be a nice village, but now it's just a nest of anarchy and crime. I have no arrows. Nice. Let's get rid of him. Does it make <laughs> all of them? I swear, all of them. I have never heard so much fucking god talk from one man in all my days. <gasps> Let him go. No one on this island is allowed to say that word. Did he say Cyclops? Did it hurt your feelings? I don't like it when people call me that. Um, oh, I didn't. I but you're so fat. I mean, big, strong. You really do only have one eye. <gasps> My eye. Give it to me. Give it to me. Give it to me, and I won't kill Marcos for having you steal it. Give it to me. You want it? He just shoved up the sheep's ass. Get it. Nice. Can I find the sheep though? Coming to uh, slice you up. I want that sheep so I can take that obsidian and get myself loads of money. I uh, imagine if we kill a sheep at some point in the future and they just add it that you get the eye back. How cool would that be? Shouldn't delay here any further. Even rats like these have friends on Kefalonia. Quick. Yes, slice, slice, slice. Got him.
Go, go, go! Come on! Thank you enough. After spending most of my life at sea, it would have been absolutely shameful to drown in a pot. Ah, where are my manners? I am Varnavas, captain of the Adrestia. Well, Varnavas, I'm pleased to meet you. I'm Alexios, Mystios by trade. <laughs> oh, but you're much more than that, I'm sure. What do you mean? When they forced my head underwater, I prayed to the gods. And when they pulled it out, there you were. All of Kefalonia heard your prayers. I just happened to be closest. <laughs> and you just happened to fight like Achilles while Zeus's eagle flies around your head. Uh-huh. So you have a ship? Of course. Gods forbid I'd end up stuck in this place. Where is it now? Thanks to you, it's still in Sami Harbor, where I left it. Uh, I could use your help. Perhaps the fates brought us together after all. I'm in need of a ship and a crew. <laughs> you saved my life. It would disgust the gods to not offer it in return. So, that's a yes. My ship, my crew, and my services are yours. You truly aren't from around here. Ha <laughs> ha! Gods, no! And I thank them for that! Come now and see the Adrestia! Nice! Where is it we gotta go? Oh, we gotta go miles away! Right, let's call our horse and be on our way! Here we go. Right, we are here and we need to speak to Barnabas now. We are ready when you are, Captain. Wait! Wait for me, Alexios. I'm all packed and everything. You're coming, are you? If you're going, I'm going. Kefalonia is the only place you've ever known. You'd leave your home. I would if it meant staying with you. You can't go where I'm going. I need to be alone. Who's going to keep you company? I'll be fine. If Aww. I can't come, then take Hara. Hara? My pet eagle. She's my friend. Mother gave her to me. But she'll be your friend now. And it'll be like I'm there with you. You know, to remind you of me. Thanks, Phoebe. But you have to promise we'll see each other again. I promise. You haven't seen the last of me. Just stay out of trouble until then. I will. Don't worry. Okay, you can leave now. No. Alexios! Leaving Kefalonia without saying goodbye to your dear Marcos? Tell me it isn't true. Well, you're here now, so it won't be true. Goodbye, Marcos. All these years as a dynamic duo! I'll never replace you! Well, I may need another assistant someday, but it won't be easy. Come now, give me a hug! <sighs> All right, come here. Yes, bring it in. Oh, will I ever miss you, Alexios? Thanks, Marcos. I'll miss you too. And what does the future hold for you? Wine, of course! <laughs> Though you never know when the vines will wither. I'm always ready for another adventure. Speaking of adventure, I have a task for you, dear Phoebe. An adventure? 
Yes! Already following in your footsteps, isn't she, my friend? Yeah. <laughs> Ready to set sail? Ah, uh, let's go. Prepare to cast off. <laughs> it's time to leave. Good. The tides wait for neither man nor woman. Time to go. Let's go. So, what course do we set? Where in this big, beautiful world does the mighty Alexios want to go? Megaris. <laughs> Megaris? But we'll be sailing into war. I got a contract for some general's head. Whose head? They call him the Wolf. The Wolf? Who wants Nikolaos of Sparta dead? Nikolaos of Sparta? <laughs> the Oracle has spoken! <laughs> to prevent Sparta's fall, the child must fall first. You can't let this happen! Please, she'll do no harm. She'll help us. She will lead us! Silence! Oh shit. Get me to Megaris. Now. But I don't understand. Of all the places under Ilios, why risk our necks to go there? The wolf of Sparta is my father. Wow. Oh my gosh, that was a um... nothing like a sea breeze. Does the deck always feel like it's moving? <laughs> I've got the perfect opportunity for you to get your sea legs. Oh, what would that be? Well, when the Cyclops was giving me a drumming, his pirates took my cargo. I know their ship, and I know where they're heading. What say we get it back? Sure. It'll be a good opportunity to see how your ship and crew perform. 
Great idea. Let's go. Maximum speed. Increase speed, Commander. Everyone, brace yourselves. Go. Come on. So we've got all the archers on top. Come on, come on. Let's ram. I lost a couple good men in the scrap with those pirates. The seas are more dangerous now that Sparta and Athens are at each other's throats. We need new recruits to better our crew. I know where to start. The best archer I know. He'd be a valuable asset. When can we meet him? Well. You're going to have to persuade him. What do you mean? You get him aboard and I'll talk him into it. A little drachmi should sweeten the deal. So you want me to knock him out? No, no. Well, maybe just pacify him a little. Then get him to the ship so we can have a little talk. Everything will be fine. I promise you. It better be fine. Right, where do we need to go? <laughs> They're enjoying themselves. Du, 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 du. At least they're not a miserable crew. Um, right, so we have uh, a couple more abilities to get. Uh, Sparta Kick seems good. Let's go. Send Icarus up to get the lay of the land. He'll spot my target. That's my target. How do we get up here then?
Just like that. There's a body here. I'm out of arrows again. Let's go. Slice him up. Loot this guy's body. Nice. Uh, we got a bit of loot that we can loot here. Oh, and arrows. Only five, but five is better than nothing at this rate. Join me and my crew. You're a sailor at heart, just like me. You'll make a worthy addition to the crew. Just like that. Oh, open ship menu. Oh, we can view our ship now. There we go. A little bit of a drag me. Never hurt anyone. Here we go, we're on. Is that the guy that we just kidnapped? I got him. Good. He'll be a valuable asset to the crew. Will he be enough? Don't worry. There'll be plenty of opportunities to recruit more people as we go. Something tells me we're going to need them. We should set a course for Megaris. A long voyage can be relaxing, but we are not really the cruising type. If you want to spice things up a bit, you can always check my log over there. I make a note of anything I hear that could be of interest. To it. Oh, interesting. Um, so whereabouts are... Oh, we have loads of quests. But we are heading to Megaris right now. Which is all the way over here. So, how long have we been recording this for? Um, we can make the journey there. Undock shit. Good to have you back, Commander. Sailing speed. All down. That is pretty cool. Oh, do I have to stay in command? I thought I could, like... Right, so we're going to have to attack... Um, some people by the looks of it. Come on.
Nice! Oh, that doesn't really do much. We still have to destroy it. Right, we need to ram into this guy again. Speed up. Perfect. Right, we're nearly at the shore. Head for open water. Running speed. Onward. The roads be tight to this. More speed. We need to let the roads catch their breaths. Oh, we're in the docks now. Let's see how this cutscene goes. I think we're speaking to his dad now, I think. I think that's what I got from the last cut cutscene. Come on, load. fears you. He cowers in his Parthenon, surrounded by playwrights and sophists. He dares not face you with honor on the battlefield. He knows you are too strong. He knows Athens' days in Margolis are numbered. And he knows Athens is next! destroyed the Athenian blockade. They were in my way. Sparta owes you thanks. Dichi has blessed you, my friend. You arrived in time to watch my pater achieve a glorious victory. If Nicolaus is your father, I guess that makes you my brother. Did you take a blow to the head during battle? What are you talking about? The wolf is my father, as well as yours. Ridiculous. Before he adopted me into his home, he had two children. And they both died in Sparta many years ago. Except for the one standing before you now. You almost fooled me. 
But I wasn't born yesterday, Mysterious. Let's stick to the subject of why you're here. What is a mercenary doing sailing into a war they aren't being paid to fight in? Tell me why you're really here before I cut you down for wasting my time. I've come to meet the wolf of Sparta. <laughs> you cannot simply meet with Nikolaos. He has command of the entire Spartan army. If you truly came all this way to meet him, you might be disappointed. Are you sure you're in charge here? You don't strike me as a typical Spartan. Perhaps it's best if I just talk with Nikolaos. A sense of humor is not a trait I see being useful for a Celso. If you're here to earn Drachmi, though, I could make use of a capable mercenary. The fleet might be destroyed, but Megaris is firmly in Athenian control. We need to weaken their position if we are to take to the field and drive them back to Athens. Your father, who is he exactly? Nikolaos, the wolf of Sparta. He was impressed with my skill when I was a boy and took me under his wing. He trained me himself and eventually adopted me into his house. He is my father and mentor. I live to make him proud. Surely you've heard of him. Just rumors, really. I doubt they do him justice. He is a great warrior. ...and a greater general. I would follow him to the gates of the Underworld. How goes the war effort? The Athenian blockade was a desperate attempt to stop our advance through Megaris. Now, we can prepare to drive them from this region once and for all. Our forward scouts are identifying key targets in preparation for our assault. Under the Wolf's command, we shall be victorious. Why do you need a mercenary to do that? You seem to have plenty of soldiers at your disposal. It's not a question of manpower. The Megarians are our allies. We do not want to commit troops until we know victory is assured. My scouts are already locating key targets that we can hit. I'll help you rid Megaris of Athenians for a price. He's Even stopping us from seeing our father, so honor, I'm gonna make him job. pay. But your skills are better serving us than our enemy. The Athenians already have a mercenary working for them. They don't need more help. If we can draw the leader out and eliminate him, we will crush the Athenians on the battlefield and drive their forces all the way back to Athens, destroying their supplies, stealing their war chest, and killing their elite troops should leave him vulnerable. Take this and present it to my scouts. If you find them in the field, be sure to check for new information. They might also have need of your skills. I think I know what must be done. Remember, every Athenian soldier you eliminate will also help us achieve victory. And once I've brought the Athenians to their knees for Sparta, I'll get that meeting with Nikolaos. Or you'll be next. Send those Athenian dogs to Hades, Mystios. Do this, and the wolf will personally see to it that you are rewarded. Conquering nations. To meet your father, Nikolaos, help Senator conquer Megaris. To do this, we can Megaris' nation power enough to trigger the conquest battle. Oh. The most effective way to lower the nation power is to kill the nation leader. He's always accessible, but while defended when nation power is high. To lower the nation power and weaken his defences, kill soldiers from the faction in power, burn war supplies, and pillage the nation treasure. Okay. Uh, a sponsor has put a bounty on you because of your illegal actions such as killing civilians or soldiers, stealing and sinking ships. To remove the bounty, use the pay all bounties action on the map. Pay each sponsor on the map or kill the sponsors in the world. Keep a low profile until it expires. I could probably just pay all the bounties and leave it like that for now. Um, I think I also have a... Do I have a bounty here as well?
Uh, I do not. But that is going to do it for today's episode. If you did enjoy, be sure to leave a like, comment down below and subscribe. And if you want to help support the channel, hit that join button. It would mean the world to me. And I will see you in the next one. Goodbye.